Hi, my name is Dave, and today we're going to be going over the setup of the ShootSteel.com Static T-Post Target Hanger and Protector. This product allows you to easily hang a target on readily available fence post and have a protector to protect that fence post. Before we go over installation, let's go over what's included and what you will need to complete the setup process. Included in the package is the static holder and hardware, which consists of a bolt, nut, and spring. The protector will include the protector itself, two spacers, and the hardware. The only tools needed for assembly are basic hand tools. You can either use a traditional wrench or a socket and ratchet. You will also need a target. Different shapes and sizes are available at ShootSteel.com. Last, you will need a section of T-Post, which is available at most home improvement and farm supply stores. Begin by inserting the bolt into the face of the target. We can now rotate the target face down so it holds the bolt in place. Place the spring onto the bolt. Now we can place the holder onto the bolt, making sure the groove on the back is towards the back of the target. Place the nut and begin to snug. Now using your hand tools, begin to tighten the nut so that you can press the spring approximately one half of an inch. Also make sure that the nut is tightened sufficiently so that the nylon locking insert of the nut is holding onto the bolt. Once completed, the assembly should look like this. Once you're at the range, you will take your T-post and drive it into the ground, and the static hanger goes over the top as shown, with the groove to the rear for the spline of the T-post. Now you can determine the proper height of the protector. In our configuration, we're able to set up the protector so the hardware is protected by the target. Insert the two carriage bolts in the face of the protector, making sure they are engaged. Then place a spacer on the back. Then place the protector onto the T-post, with the spacer going in between two of the nubs on the T-post. Place the other spacer behind the T-post onto the carriage bolts, and install both nuts and snug down. Now using your wrench, tighten both of the nuts evenly so the protector is held in place with even torque on both bolts. You can now place your target back on the T-post and again, the hardware from the protector is protected by the target. Setup of the ShootSteel.com static T-post hanger and protector are now complete. If you have any questions about the setup, don't hesitate to reach out to the technical support staff at ShootSteel.com. As always, make sure you're shooting at a safe distance and that your backstop and area are safe to shoot with steel targets. Thank you very much for watching and have a great day.